After missing the 2023 award ceremony, Kevin Costner made up for lost time at the 2024 Golden Globes, looking dapper on the red carpet. On Sunday, January 7th, Costner, 68, made a solitary trip down the red carpet at the Beverly Hilton in Beverly Hills, California. He was dressed in a traditional black tuxedo, which included a clean white shirt and a bow tie. At one point when he entered the stadium, he added a little flair by donning sunglasses and giving the assembled throng a peace sign. Prior to the ceremony on Sunday, January 7th, Costner was listed as one of the A-list presenters. Given that the actor had declared in January 2023 that flooding close to his Santa Barbara, California home prevented him from attending the Globes, it seemed as though his attendance at this year's ceremony was a do-over. At the time, Forbes reported that thousands of people had been evacuated from the region and that 17 people had died. In an Instagram video, Costner said, Today, we had to pull the kids out of school, and in Santa Barbara, this is the second time in five years. The freeways flooded out. Last night, we realized we were on the wrong side of town and were unable to return. Because the highways were closed this morning, we were unable to return to the house in time. No one is more disappointed than us that we are unable to attend the Golden Globes, the Yellowstone star said in an apology. Christine Baumgartner, his ex-wife, had a beautiful dress. I was looking forward to walking down the red carpet with her, he continued. But not everyone, including host Regina Hall, felt sorry for Costner. Hall, 53, made fun of Costner's circumstances when she declared him the winner of the Best Actor in a Drama Series Award for his role as John Dutton on Yellowstone. No, this is currently a depressing story. He's confined to Santa Barbara. Everyone should pray, Hall joked. Everyone, we do, we pray, and we hope everyone affected by these storms remains safe, she continued, adopting a more solemn tone. Kevin, I'm going to present that award there in your honor. With Baumgartner, 49, and their three children, Caden, 16, Hayes, 14, and Grace, 13, at home, Costner celebrated his victory. Costner also has son Liam, 27, with ex-wife Bridget Rooney, and daughters Annie, 39, and Lily, 37, as well as son Joe, 35, with ex-wife Cindy Silva. In February 2023, as he displayed his trophy to his supporters on Instagram, he shared his memories of the evening's events. When they were told they would have to miss the show, Costner recalled, My wife, with 30 bucks, went down to the store, I'll never forget this, and she bought about 30 balloons because it was just going to be us and our family in the den watching the Golden Globes. Baumgartner then attempted to console him, Something we both dreamed of being there, my dream of receiving an acting nomination, was very significant to me, and we were unable to attend. My kids heard our names called, and we weren't at one of the greatest parties in the world. Like we wanted to be, but we found ourselves together as a family, Costner said as he and his family settled in to watch the performance on the couch. After winning the Golden Globes in 2023, Costner underwent a lot of changes. To start, he separated from Baumgartner, who filed for divorce in May 2023 after 18 years of marriage. The couple finalized their divorce in September 2023 after a protracted legal struggle that featured a lot of back and forth over child support. Since then, Costner and Jewel have parted ways. After being sighted together in the Caribbean in December 2023, the two were first connected. But according to an exclusive source who spoke with us weekly, they had been dating for a while. The informant stated last month that Jewel and Kevin had a very high view of one another and had always gotten along well. They fulfill a lot of requirements for one another. According to the insider, Costner and Jewel, 49, have been in the same social circles for years. Kevin just wants to go with the flow, and so does she, the source said. However, everyone agrees that Jewel is a true keeper and that this has the potential to be something truly remarkable.